Now a word from the Canadian government. Hey guys. What's going on? Listen, I don't want to have to do this. I'm going to do it. I, got, I have to do it. I have to do it. I have to do it because I love you. Let's be honest, I don't know any of you, okay? I don't actually physically know the majority of the people in this room, but I really do care about you, mostly because you care about me. And it's not as selfish as you think. In my mind, when I stand in front of a group of people, even if you are monsters in your real lives, I don't know. All I think to myself is, I love these people. I want these people to be safe. I want these people to get married, even if I don't buy into that patriarchal institution. I want people to have happiness in whatever way or shape or form that they desire. I, I believe that everybody deserves that same opportunity and those same chances, no matter where they come from, no matter what they look like. And this is not, this is not hippy dippy bullshit. I'm a fucking capitalist. I love, I love bad things. I like money. I, this is just me saying that I, I, I believe when I stand in front of an audience that you guys are like me and I want you to have the same things that I would want. And one of the things about being queer and out is that I have always felt that our audience is more open-minded than, than other audiences. And I also feel and I also feel like I have had the privilege of kind of being in a bit of a bubble my whole life. Even, even when in our career we felt like people said bad things about us or people have written bad things about us, for the most part, our strength has come from our audience. And it's come from you guys being such amazing allies and support and community. And, and it's so amazing. But, sometimes I think that people forget that there are so many other people who need our support and who need the, the allyship and the community and the solidarity that we have sometimes at these shows. This election in America, whatever it meant a year ago or three months ago or even four weeks ago has changed. I beg you, I beg you to consider if you are planning on voting for the wrong person in this election, if you are planning on not voting in this election, if you are planning on voting for a third party in this election, I just ask you to think about people like me who would do anything to vote in this election, who would do anything to try and show my support for the millions and millions of people in this country right now who, who's, seriously, whose futures depend on this election. Don't underestimate that if Donald Trump were to become president, that there would be millions of people who would suffer. Think about those people on election day. That's all I ask from you. That's it. I also want to say one other thing, and I saw a lot of people talking about this online today. I believe that a lot of you would vote the way that I would vote. And maybe you would say to me, and I've had a lot of people say this, oh, my parents are voting for Trump. I'm not asking you to put yourself in danger or cause any family drama, but you would be amazed at how, how, how powerful it is to tell your parents, please vote for me, please vote for my future. And I, I want you to know, full disclosure, that I have lots of people in my family who are conservative, and I have asked, I don't know why that person is yelling, if they're saying there's a bear on stage or if they hate my guts, I don't know. But I just want to say this last thing. I'm not, I'm not telling you, I wouldn't be disappointed if you didn't, but if you have a conservative friend or a conservative family member, it's okay to ask them to consider you or the other people in this country who need some solidarity right now. So that's it. Thank you so much. I cannot wait for this election to be over. I can't.
show. We've got four songs left. Four. And now, all that, all that stress and all that anxiety that I have, that I'm sure you have, let's fucking dance this shit out. Are you guys ready? You can keep your day, your name. You can keep your. 